The spotlight is nothing new for Adam Copeland. Many know him as a multi-time world champion in the wrestling world. It is a story, so a movie, a sitcom, a the soap opera, but all rolled into one. Known in the squared circle as Edge, he mastered those elements and gained fans worldwide because of it. But in 2011, he sustained a neck injury. Wrestling was my, uh, that was it. Um, there, there was no other option. Uh, but then you're told you have to retire. But just as it looked like the bright lights were fading, another opportunity emerged from the shadows. Thanks to executives with the Sci-Fi Network show, Haven. They watched my retirement speech and they were in tears, not knowing that I wasn't acting. I was ending the only thing I've ever wanted to do. Copeland went down a new path, picking the brains of actors instead of wrestlers. And then just sitting with directors and, and asking them why they made the choices they made, other actors and asking them why they made the choices they made. And everyone was really super gracious in, in helping me learn this thing. A role in the show Vikings on the History Channel continued Copeland's journey as an actor. I walked off of that show going, okay, I feel like I rounded a corner here. His third show would cast him in the biggest light yet as an actor, getting the role of Ares in Disney's Percy Jackson and the Olympians, just as author of the original novel series Rick Riordan wanted. He was the one who chose me. You know, he, he saw my audition and he was like, no, that's how I always pictured Ares as I wrote him. While Copeland had worked over 100 episodes of television to this point, he was still feeding off the energy of his teenage co-stars. Walker and Arian are just like, how many push-ups do you do? Uh, so like, what can you bench? Percy Jackson gained millions of viewers and was one of the most watched shows in all of 2023. I started having like families, kids, grandparents come up and say, are you, and I'm used to Edge or, or Adam Copeland. Aries? I play Aries, yeah, yeah. I asked Copeland why this transition from wrestling to acting has gone as well as it has. I'm a storyteller, so I, I still want to tell a story, yeah, however that is, whether it's writing, whether it's um, you know, a television show, a movie, or whether it's wrestling. After healing from the 2011 injury, Copeland is back in the ring for All Elite Wrestling this time. However, he says he only has one full-time job. I don't think I'll ever be a, a full-time anything besides dad. They keep you grounded because they don't care if you're on a TV show or if you're a wrestler, you're your dad. Through all of his travels, Copeland, with his wife, Beth, and two daughters, Lyric and Ruby, settled down in Asheville. Our, our roots are, are deep now. You know, we've... Uh, established a, you know, a framework for our kids for the rest of their lives. Like fatherhood is, is easily the best thing I've ever been involved in. It just changes everything, but it changes it all for the better.